Hello and welcome back to Norway Crusader Kings 2, um, Sweden, most of Finland, you know, everywhere, north, uh, was that Estonia? And of course, the north of France, and most of England, and oh, a little bit of Wales. Lovely. Sorry, lovely. That was a very bad Welsh accent, so I'm sorry for any Welsh people watching. Uh, we're we're moving on swiftly. Our oh, Lincoln is now Scottish again. Damn it! They'd re kind of lost their Scottishness at one point, but now they've re-Scottishized, which is annoying because it kind of it's, it's, it's messy. And I'd really like somebody to take it back, but I can't be bothered to do it myself because I'm very busy up here in Cantalati. I have. Two places to siege, uh, a number of troops there. We are chasing Yuvan, the army of Yuvan, after we had a little bit of a battle, which uh, gave us 49% in the uh, war score, which is nice. Let's just press play, get things going. Uh, we've got no money really to spend, more men coming down. This should be easy. Uh, Duke Robert now favours himself as the heir to the Kingdom of England. Okay. Good for you, Robert. We are currently keeping England, but this keeps changing. A lot. Uh, oh yes, I'm possessed. I forgot that. That I am now possessed by uh, Duke Arling now favours uh, Count Owl as the heir to Kingdom of Sweden. Okay. Yes, I'm possessed. I'm speaking in tongues. Uh, my head spinning around. Um, pretty much exorcist kind of stuff. Duke Otar now has Prince Eigel. Oh dear. You could lose Sweden at this rate. But, oh, Duke Minka now favours Duke Archel as the heir to the Finland. What's happening? Why are people not liking. I mean, Aslak's 54 already. She's a bugger. But, you know. Oh, Duke, Duke Minka now favours himself. Duke. Alexander now favours you, Godfrey, who has a lovely beard and some lovely hair. Blimey, everything's changing. Somebody seeks to kill somebody. Yeah, I'm possessed. Uh, I didn't seem to have any negative aspects, which is a surprise, considering generally being possessed is not a good thing. Uh, moving this army in here. Well, this army is just finishing off the Cola army. The, the Karelian Cola. Coca Cola army here. Very flat, very easy terrain. Uh, both swords and shields. Just it's a bit predictable that attacking style. They're just you know, swinging. They should try some backhanded and stabby things. But no. Oh. Duke Otar the Second of Vestergotland has usurped the title County of Halland from Ogmund Aslaxon. Oh, bugger. Victory is mine. Good. Uh, Duke Alexander now favours himself. Okay, we're not losing anything. Um, oh, see, I gave Halland to that guy on purpose, and then he just took it, you bastard. I do have a few... Oh. I never noticed that the uh, Kingdom of Kemi looked so much like Riverrun and the Tully. It's like the Tullys from Game of Thrones. Or the songs of Song of Ice and Fire, as the book is more uh, correctly called. Um, yeah, interesting. Okay, we're going to stick in Cola. We're going to stick in Cantalati. Sixty-five percent. Uh, they, they shouldn't last too long. Eight. Oh, accepted. 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 It declined. Uh, uh, declined. Uh, declined. I'm really living a long time. I'm a bit worried about the next guy because he's not going to be as popular as this guy. Sverre is very popular because he kind of ended the... Oh, hello. My liege, it is most unfortunate you happen to hold a title that all agree should rightfully be mine. In order to lift this dark cloud from our relations, may I suggest adjustment? What do you want? You want the county of Angerman land? Wrong... No. I shall reject diplomatically. It's better than saying fuck off. 
mine. Because I think that might annoy him a bit. So I'll be nice. Because, you know, it's nice to be nice. Okay. I'll speed things up a little bit. So... Use will speed up. Smallpox has broken out in York. Never mind. Maybe Oswin can die. He's annoying. What you got in the plot? Plot-wise. Where's plots? Factions. Uh, oh, Duke Erling uh, Atlas, Duke Ogman is the editing of Sweden. Not a problem. Uh, our holding in Finnmark is under siege. Really? Oh. Really? No, they can't. Uh, Bishop Harold of Uppsala died in actual death at 53. It's very sad. Um, seeks to fabricate a home duck from the Fundland. I don't give a shit. We don't have any major factions here. Five, six, four, four, two, one. Yeah, nothing to worry about. Hunger strikes the fastness under siege. The hunger bite. Defending troops, 5% loss. Good. Uh, Countess Felicia of Bruges has accepted, no, inherited the county of Bruges, Brugge, Bruges, from Count Tybalt of Bruges. Oh, Tybalt's dead. Died to this stress at the age of 74. Um, what else we got? Uh, did not inherit his uh, claim hand of Ghent. Finmarks. Whoa, things are happening. Slow down. Snowfrid Uzdwatter. Been imprisoned by Duke Trond. Finmark is on the sea. Yeah, no. Declined. Did not inherit Ghent. Uh, you want to uh, pick part of the Aragonian claim on Zaragotha. Zaragotha. Yeah, we'll, we'll help you out, mate. When we finish this, we will maybe send some down. I'm not promising anything, but... Maybe. Maybe we will. How are we doing in terms of religion? Is it still Fraticelli? It is still Fraticelli, that's still Swaminuskan. Other than that, we're doing... Oh, that's still Orthodox. Hurry up, Mr. Uh, Ch Court Chaplain Finn. You've been doing that for ages. He'll finish one day. Uh, 86.6, 58.5, 90, 58.5, 90, 58.5. Catches Gertrude of Headmark, and Edward Duke Tron, the first officer of the Republic of Peace. Um, Hunger Strikes of Fastness, good. Uh, being released. Well, she's only young, you can't keep her in dungeons. Duke Trond of Oslander won that war. Oh, Where is it? Headmark? Where is it? Oh, there. Countess Gertrude of Headmark is in prison. It's very sad for her. I wish my vassals weren't so vicious towards one another. But at the same time, I can't be bothered to do anything about it. Now, are they going to take Narva or Ingria? I want them to, because that means I can then take it straight away, because I've currently got a truce with um, Russia, the Russian guy. Is he still a Russian guy? Oh, Russ has become back together again, that's unfortunate. Countess Gertrude Hedmark has been released from prison, uh, decided to release her from prison, yes. Yeah, he's still alive. Victory! The Siege of Cantalati. Fantastic. Now we're sieging Pio Zero. Pio Pia, Piao Zero. Uh, construction in England has increased. So yeah, he's still alive. 63, so I can't attack Russia. And... Offer peace. Uh, to the great king, Svera the First. Blessings upon you and your house. We surrender under these terms. Count King's Vera becomes Count Baby's new liege. Yeah. The Norwegian Karelian de Jure War of Cantalati has ended. King's Vera the First in Norway won. Let's see what it became. It became. Candelax. Disband. Disband down here as well. So he's got. You left. Can we, um. Offer vassalization? No. So I'm going to have to take Kohler off his hands by force, but I've got to wait for that. Is there any way I can... Mm, to give me the option to choose the plot? Mm, 17%, no. 
It would be good though to finally get all of kind of Scandinavia, Scandinavia. So I've got a little bit of Denmark left, but I can't attack that because I've got a truce with the um, Danish king, the monk. Yeah, it can go pretty well. I'm happy. But I'll just worry about converting here, here, and here. And then here and here are on my list. As are here, 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 and here. And here, 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 and here, unfortunately. Which is a bit awkward because that's how you're own. And I probably don't want to um, take on the Holy Romans. Shall we go to Zaragoza? No, I've kind of disbanded my troops now, haven't I? God, how long did it take for you to walk that far into Candlax? There's probably no roads up there. It's cold, icy. Forested, apparently. I thought it would be, be more snowy than that, up in northern Finland. But you can be disbanded. There we go. No armies. Should increase my monthly, or weekly, or yeah, monthly income. Because I'm not paying for an army. The armies are expensive. Ooh. Pomoria. Uh, occupied by rebels. That is uh, Bjarmia. Bjarmia. They are Orthodox and Russian. That's Polotskian. Come on, Polotsk, take this. Ah, they're in Pskov. Count Victor III is excommunicated Count of this year of Bruges at the behest of Count Nicholas of Ypres. Ypres, very nice place. Uh, Ursul is being. Count Siegfried of. Ursul is being sieged by um, Grand Prince Dimitri I of Gallic in the Gallican Ursulian de Jour war over Ursul. Oh. He's also attacking King Siegfried, Siegfried the Monk in the Holsteiner war for Ingvar's claim on Denmark. So this will be the perfect time to head into So this isn't under control of this guy, nor is Finn. Uh, Count Tord of Ross has declared the Rus Russian war for Count Paul's claim on Orkney. On Duchy, Duchy Astrid. <laughs> Can I declare war on this guy? I need a valid Casus Belli. Okay. Could you fabricate claims in there, please? Because that is not held by this guy. The king. Is this held by the king? Yes. So, Zhiland, that one, is not held by the king, which means I can take it. Whereas these are all held by the king, which means I can't. Because I've got a truce with him. I'm going to speed it up a bit. I have a, 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 a truce. Oh, hello. A bit old. I have a truce with um, King Sigtrid the monk until 1202. Training grounds have been built in Ordenborg. Fantastic. Prince Igor of Norway has been sent to. Yes, I've done. I just did that. Accepted a call to war. Oh, 248. Probably not have money to buy anything. Build anything just yet? Peasants have revolted in Bologna. Okay. Have they indeed? How many? Not that many. How many can I raise in? Well, I can raise 5,000 troops in there and just walk in. <laughs> Not going to be a problem. That's that sorted. Right, if you can do that, I can then take that. And then I can take that one as well. Oh, that's still the same. Oh, no, it's a different guy. Glum. Count Glum. Oh, bless. My king, I am pleased to report the majority of the population rebel have been converted to Catholic faith. Ah, excellent. Excellent. 
So now, we just have Niland and Satakunda left to take. To turn over to the one true faith. Uh, the Battle of Montreal. Done. Good. You can disband then. Got rid of that little rebellion. Nice and quick. Uh, one uh, holding in Bologna is under siege, yes, but it's not anymore. And I am now 75. This guy is still there. King Nikita of Russia. Fantastic. It's just what I needed. Because that means now I believe there is no truce with Russia. Russia. Because the Russians dead. So I get to take Ingria or Narva. Okay, Narva's going to be harder because it has a fort. It's got three places. Ingria only has one. speed up and see what's gonna happen he's got some men let's just wait for him to lose his men trying to take Ingria back right that war's ended okay 7,000 men it's a lot of men so he's now got everything again this is held by the Duchy of Biarmia this is all held by the Duchy of Biarmia. And that's being seized as well, so maybe now is a good time to take out Narva. Because he's having problems in other places. Do you reckon? Well, he's a big warring person. He's orthodox, he's a scholar with four nine learning. Oh, not a great scholar. What claims? Fifteen weak claims. I had Kingdom of Denmark for Asta Stenkling, but that doesn't help me because she's not my family or my um, vassal already, which means I wouldn't take it, but she would. Which would be um, not great. In fact, there's nobody in there who I can look and think. I can maybe get a Kingdom of Lotharinga, the Count Gunnar of Sudermanland. Uh, David Wessex, I could help him. Oh, no, one's gone. What the Holy Romans doing up here? <coughs> Shaland is being occupied. Riga is being occupied. Ursul is at war. And Lytle Lepiel. Where's Lepiel? Oh, a bit of a mess up here. Duke Oton echoes Prince Aslak as the editing in Sweden. Good. Narva. Shall we do it? We can't declare war on you, no, because you're not independent. But I can declare war. Oh. I say this is Biarmia and Lipel. Wow, Cumania is huge. Okay, this is nothing. There's a lot of war going on. A lot of war going on. Oh! Let's do it. Where were you? Vladimir. Vladimir. Um. Uh. Declare war. I can 
No, I want I want Narva, please. I shall ask oh he's a very young king, oh no he isn't. Right, let's raise some oh to my we can of oh. Well poo, poo to you. Press pause, raise some troops. Military, raise my own troops, obviously. Raise 44,000. Don't think I'm going to need 44,000. So Let's all gather together in Upland. We will use our Trondelagians, probably, but we should raise some ships. 13 ships is enough. Embark. Come around to the Sea of Holland. Thank you. Thank you kindly. Obviously, we got the 2000 get from Osso. It's always welcome. Uh, where else do we have big. It's like a military map. No, no, there isn't. But what's that? 2,000. I've got 2,000. That's 45,000. Small lands has a few, doesn't it? 400. Hmm. Dahl. Oh, yep, 2,000. We'll also walk some round, I think. We'll walk 4,000 round and just. Um, Ship 2000 in, maybe? Wanagar 211 Lost Corallian, we've already got him Kicks on 340 Candlax uh, 460 There's a lot up here as well, isn't it, Finmark? I can get like, I don't know Here, yeah 3000 from there Now we could even use some of our English Like the 5000 from here, maybe. We need 50 ships for that. Do I have 50 ships? 41? It's all set. Oh, yeah, I have 50 ships. So I could, could use my English army. Yay, I won a war. Without going again. It's a long way to go. And 11.96. Yeah, I think I'm going to need... Yours. And your ships we go together. That would be lovely. Um, merge. Yes. Embark. Come around to here. Actually, I should be able to fit everyone on ships this time then. Should we just go straight for Narva? See what hits me before Biarmia decides to take it? Uh, 13. Yeah, I don't have... Don't have room for any more. Where are... Oh, Gunhild is the air, no. Seeks to kill somebody. Seeks to kill. Not a very good thing to do, killing people, but never mind. I'll probably just drop the 5,000 in Reval. Could I raise any troops in Reval? Oh, good enough, actually. Maybe you can go to the Gulf of Finland. And I'll drop you off in Reval. And 
then we'll use these ships. So I'll drop the open Revile as well. Revile, Revel. Uh, yes, I know. And if you 71 can come back here. be fantastic because then I can stick everyone on that ship. Fantastic. Go into the Gulf. You go into the Neeland and disband because I don't need you anymore. What? Why didn't you come on this ship? Oh, I'll probably fit. Nice. And then we can come back. You. Merge. Need somebody to take the center. Old, you on the center? There you go. Why didn't you. Oh, yeah, you didn't fit. 11,000 is walking to Narva. And then, where are you going? Why is this Plotskin army coming to Kepton? Kepton. Uh, has been imprisoned. Okay. Uh, Countess Edith of Katarnas has been imprisoned. Fair enough. Holding in one ago who's under siege. Is it? No, it isn't. We'd have 2,000 Novgorodians here in Ladigo La Ladigoga. Ladigoga. I'm gonna. Uh, Conan Donan. Count Donan. Conan Donan? Count Donan North has accepted an offer of peace. That's good. The world war against tyranny of Duke Eustace for these is in one piece. Good. Uh, you're not alone for coming. Uh, Duke Robert revoked the county of Northumberland from Albert of Bamborough. Uh, Robert Normandy has become the Count of Northumberland. Okay. These 2,000. I would like to put in Raval. These are our, our, our kind of reserve troops. I'm not going to need the ships anymore. We have a little reserve army, we have a big army taking Narva. Speed things up, nobody seems to be coming to meet us. No, we're not going to. We're going to do this properly. Uh, Duke Turquetti of Essex revoked the barony of Argentan from Carl Mab Edwin. Oh, that's very sad. Turkwil de Normandy has become Baron of Argentan. Never mind. Um, we've got a Russian army from Rodislav, Count Gavril, and all that. Attacking Ladoga for Palots because they're all. They're at war with each other. In fact, Polotsk is now just that. Is the lost or didn't they have that? Is there more? Oh well, never mind. Pskov. Oh hello. How many defenders have we got? Seven hundred and eleven. Another Russian army of a thousand. Duke Minka now favours Duke Ogman to the Ice Kingdom of Finland. Holding in one of on the siege, yes. Um, <clears throat> right. If you go to Narva, we'll end that siege quick and then we will wander our 11,000 troops up into a Wanaga. Boost on it, they've only got one. Yeah, they're gonna lose that, but this Karalian. Yeah, okay. Don't want to lose the 80% I've got. Then we'll wander and meet them on the battlefield. Uh, I want this one.
The jihad for Africa failed. Allah, it seems, does not favour the Muslim faithful. After a string of defeats and setbacks, Caliph al is called off the jihad for Africa in the and third of the Holy Roman Empire. Pathetic. Yes, could you wander out? Uh, Duke Ming can now favours himself. The jihad for Egypt fails. Pathetic. When are you going to get there? September. Victory, the siege of Agulan. Okay. Died a natural death. Failed Sally by the defenders. Sally fourth, they were caught unawares. Oh dear. Uh, 14th of November. Let's go into Estralan, please. Uh, Gunhill died of period illness. She died a natural death. They seem to have decided they want to attack me in my homeland rather than trying to take me where I'm attacking them, which is nice. I would have sent those 8,000 troops to attack here. Well, maybe they saw the 11,000. Uh, Somebody died a natural death. I am getting really old. I'm too old for this. What are we sieging now? Um, Narva. Fort level 1.7, Fort level 3. It could take a while. Come on. Just click it up to... My liege, I'm pleased to report the success of my mission to Satakunda. Thank God. They're no longer Fraticellis. I will now use you in Neeland. Because they also have an issue. Uh, Oscar, 9th of December. Uh, the disease strikes the besieging army. 5% uh, losses. Fantastic. Died comatose in bed. That's very sad. Seeks to kill somebody. Oh! We've got war on our hands. Disease! Yes! Another 5% losses. Can I get there before it's fully sieged? Typhus has broken out in Mortain, never mind. 9th of December. We'll go all the way. Uh, errant subject inquiry has uh, quoted the county play. Good. No, 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 no. When are you going to get out? You're going to get out on um, 20th of January. I'm going to get in on 20th of December. Good. We should have our war. I've got good, good, um, good, good war here. Good war. Good, good people here. Or saving. Oh, I'm even fighting the king. We all can take the king. Oh, they're losing people much quicker than I am. Oh yeah, six thousand. Uh. Yes! In the chaos of battle, your men have managed to corner King Nikita the First. He resisted bravely before, the, before they slew him. Good riddance. I've killed the king. Uh, we're meleeing on the one plank. I've lost more in the centre than he has. Well, a lot more on this flank. So hopefully this flank will kind of join together at some point. Go on, route, route somebody. Route, yes. That flank is routing. Now we are two on the middle. That should be good. Well, there's no army trying to meet me here, is there? No. Two thousand. They're all routing now. Kill them all. Victory. Victory is mine. Yes. Only two thousand left. That was good. Um, we will also take out this army. 
And we're just sitting here having... Oh, he's a king. King Dobrynia. The second of Russia. This is an army I need to take out as well, isn't it? Yeah, Novgorod, Moscow, and Vizama, Novgorod, Ra, Moscow, and whatever the other one was. Vyazjam, Vajma, Vyazma. Wow, so. Lost a king. Oh, you wuss, running away. Well. Stay here and save that then. Where are you going? You are going to Zayuzevia. Typhus broken out in Ross. Oh well. Victory, uh, siege of Narva. That's good. About 41% now. Uh, just got the bishopric left. Uh, Duke Athlon's and Normandy has inherited the barony of. Oh, he doesn't need more. Siege of, that's going quickly, isn't it? And then we'll probably just do some sieging for the for the giggles, really. You know, just for the shell of it. Try and get the war score up. Always useful. Oh, some money, 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 money. Uh, our plan. Do you want something built? I can build a house call training. Uh, heavy infantry, heavy infantry attack. House call training too. Yeah, done. How's my uh, tech doing? Cavalry. Siege equipment. Um, doesn't actually give me any... Um, no, I need that here, isn't it? Trade practice is almost there. Doesn't matter. Tolerance. Opinion penalty of a different culture. Well, that could be useful. Given I have a lot of different cultures, I will get tolerance. Majesty. Piety, religious customs, church, battle opinion. Better. Siege, Ust, Erniga. Done. Holy shit. Count Arling of Yentland, inherited the county of Yentland. Yeah. Died a maimed cripple. Uh, Mayor Tolerant agreed to... To divert to Catholicism. Yeah, fine. No, that's. It's a short way around, isn't it? One, two. Th 26th of May. I'm gonna get there on the 28th of May. It's gonna be a fight to get there to save this army, I think. Doesn't matter if I lose it, I mean, I've got plenty. Of other men around. It'd be disappointing, really. Uh, Count Toller of Nerik has inherited the County Nerik from Count Ingvar of Nerik, who died in Africa at the age of 68. Lovely. Yeah, what are they doing? Religious custom, popular customs, city vassal opinions, or. I'll take one of them, I suppose. I might go the religious. No, I'll go popular customs. There we go. Uh, I can buy trade practice, it doesn't matter. Shipbuilding. City shipyard, temple shipyard, castle shipyard, military organisation. Quick! Chase this army. Narva, 14th of June. 6th of July. Oh dear. Siege equipment um, comp. Yeah, shipbuilding. Galleys plus twenty percent. Military organization. Uh, global supply limit plus twenty five percent. Ah, could be useful. I wish these would start doing something. They're the ones I want. Right. Uh, Ragnar Billy has died after of illness. Eddie, Eddie, Edith has been released for being attacked in Narva. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Put up a good fight. I don't think these guys are going to get there in time, are they? Hold on. We're coming for you.
We're coming to help you. Don't worry. Worry not. We will be there soon. Keep fighting. Anyway, on that cliffhanger, will this army survive long enough for reinforcements to arrive? Will they win on their own? Find out next time in episode whatever it is of this. So yes, thank you for watching. Come back next time and goodbye.